Hello everyone. It's another weekend and I'm in Sarasota. So it's this weekend in Sarasota with Kirsten. I hope you all had a great week. I did. I celebrated Halloween and had five different costumes this year. Totally excited about that and kind of bummed that Halloween's over. So I hope that you all had a good Halloween and had fun dressing up and that you were safe so that you can celebrate the festivities coming up this weekend and the holidays to come. So, this weekend, let's get going with it. Starting Friday night at Jake's over at 3218 Clark Road. As promised, like I told you guys before, Jake's has remodeled. They've got a bigger stage in there, and they want to bring bigger acts here to Sarasota, and they have. They have delivered. They've got Josh Grayson from American Idol coming to perform Friday live, unplugged, and there are VIP available there is VIP available, sorry, I said that weird. Um, but uh, the tickets in advance are $15, and they're going to be 20 at the door. If you do want the VIP, call ahead. It's $600, but that gets you 10 tickets, uh, Grey Goose bottle, your own private seating, and some other nice perks. So call ahead, get your tickets in advance. Hopefully they haven't sold out yet. Um, so, yeah, jump on that. And thanks again to Jake's Tavern for doing that and bringing really good bands. I've gone to a couple shows there since they've remodeled, and it's so much fun. So this will be no exception. Also Friday, at another place that I love, at the Cock and Bull at 975 Cattleman Road, we've got Big Blue House with Loris Vidal and the Wooly Bushmen. That starts at 9, and hopefully it'll be a little chilly. Friday night so that they can have a fire out back because that's always fun sitting out there chilling and they do serve food at Cock and Bull so that's okay if you're a little hungry and you want to warm up as well. And they've got all those delicious craft beers and they've got a great show Friday night so thanks to them too for having some fun with us over this weekend. And this weekend, uh, continuing on with the Chalk Festival, um, they've got a speaker. Uh, Kurt Wiener is speaking over at Burns Court, and he is uh, going to be talking about recreating creativity. That starts at 9 in the morning and goes till 12. Um, and now Kurt is the uh, innovator of the 3D pavement art, which a lot of stuff is what we're going on with the Chalk Festival this week. It's all over the pavement, all over the street there on Pineapple Avenue. So go over there at Burns at 9 in the morning, uh, listen to him, get inspired, and the opening act, if you will, is the uh, Lazy Fairy Improv. So it's going to be a funny start to your day. And then after that, go check out the Chalk Festival, walk around, uh, get some things to eat. There's going to be live music, as always. And on Sunday, the band that's going to be closing down the whole uh, Burns Court is the Ship of Fools. So they're going to be at Burns Court as well, uh, performing from 9 to 11, and then is the final act Sunday for the Chalk Festival. So go over there and check out that. Gave details on that for last week's video, and uh, hopefully you got a chance to go over there and check it out. Um, and then on Sunday, uh, the Deck to Deck run. It's their fourth run, and that is the Daiquiri Deck. Starting out at the St. Armand's Daiquiri Deck location, running nine miles to the Siesta Key location, where you will be served complimentary food and beverages. Now, that registration starts at 645, uh, a little early for me, but I know a lot of my friends like to run, and this should be a good one. And uh, the Daiquiri Deck um, is also a part of Sarasota in Defense of Animals. So whenever you dine there, a portion of your check goes towards that great cause and that great group. And uh, I volunteered for them uh, several times a few years ago, but I always love going to places that are part of this community that do great things and nice things and they are they're wonderful kind people so go over there have some fun run your hearts out and uh enjoy your weekend and as always if you know more about something i mentioned please feel free to comment or if there's something that you want to talk about whether it's an event with your church or school event that you want to talk about always feel free to add to the conversation because it is all part of sarasota and as you all know I love Sarasota, and I love the people in it, so I look forward to seeing you out there, and uh, check out the photos from this weekend in next week's uh, This Week in Sarasota edition. So, uh, hope to see you all out there. Have a great weekend if I don't. I love you, Sarasota.